Blessings on blessings on blessings. We too blessed to be stressed, man. What's going on, YouTube, man? First of all, I just want to say thank you for clicking on this video. Um, today, I'm going to be reacting to. Uh, I seen a video on my YouTube feed. It says that a rapper gave his life to Christ, and honestly, like you know, just by seeing that title, I was blessed to know that somebody yo know, made the choice to turn their life over to Christ. You know, and uh, yeah, like I didn't watch the video, so I just wanted us to react to it together. And I just hope this is a blessing, man. I, like, I'm already blessed by knowing that somebody gave their life to Christ. But we're going to react to it together. And uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, to put on your post notifications so when I drop uh, any new videos, I'm going to continue growing this blessed family. So, yeah, without further ado, we're just going to get straight right into it. Let's go. Oh. Good morning, everyone. It's your boy, John Gabbana. Alright, so uh, the rapper's name is John I just have a Kibana. few things I want to say pronouncing it right. real quick regarding my last video I uploaded. Uh, how it all started. Now, in that video, you know, I, I, I showed y'all where I came from and, uh, you know, I can see that there's a lot of there's a lot weight on his heart, you know. A lot of weight on his heart. Man. That's one thing about me, man. When I start seeing other people, you don't get sad or crying, man. It makes it turns me, you know, inside, you know. And man. I didn't plan on, uh, I didn't plan on shedding tears. <laughs> All right, brother, man, let them up, man. Ain't nothing wrong with tears, man. But, so it's 1030 on a Wednesday, oh, and apparently I've sold close to $3,000 in sales on Amazon Shut already. Up. Don't believe Skip this. Skip. In that video, I showed y'all where I came from, how it started, and, um, uh, no, it was true. A lot of what I said was true, but I left out one thing. I left out one thing, and the most important thing, and I'll get to that in a second, but you know, in the last video, I spoke about I. I used a lot of I, me, 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 I, and uh, I made it seem like uh, I did this all by myself. You know, and at that moment, that's how I felt. But I know better. I know, I know better than that. I know where I'm still st If 
you're trying to lose belly fat, stop doing cardio. This sounds backwards. Well, I'm still stiff. My bad, I just want to ask you. Cut it out, brother. I know I'm still standing here. I know why I made it so far in life. I know even when I fall, even when I fail, I fall and flat on my face. I know why I was able to get back up and fight through it all. Even when I say, when even when I think about it and I say I, I read all the books. I did the hours of reading. I spent a lot of time by myself. I did this, even though I, I know why I felt like it was me. It wasn't just me. It was God. Hey. God, God, giving me the tools, the signs to even spiritually grow. God, Amen. helping me survive. Yo, that's powerful, man. What he said there, that I was so humble. Like, man, I hope you guys really realize how humble he, what he just said. He said, even though he was putting in the time to read the word or, you know, spend the time with God, you know, if he's referring to that, like, he was recognized that, recognizing that he couldn't even read or get to that point or through his spiritual uh, development with Christ. He couldn't get there without God. You know, that's really humble. You know, like, it's easy to be like, oh, I read this, I read that. I read from Genesis all the way to Revelation. You know, I did this. I'm, I'm so superior in knowledge, but literally, we can't do nothing without God. You get what I'm trying to say? Like, the air that we breathe is because of God. You get what I'm trying to say? God holds this world, you know, that we walk on, you know, He allows us to have breath. He allows us to have water and all these resources in order to live on this earth. It's because God, man, like, literally we can't move, we can't talk, we can't do nothing without God. And that was just a humble statement, man, and uh, that one touched me, man. Man, this, that, man, uh, man, I, this guy, man, so happy he turned himself to Christ, man. This is humble beginnings, man, this is humble beginnings. When I felt like I couldn't. God helping me be strong. When I felt like I was weak, yep. God giving me, give me the strength to move forward. Man. And I made it seem, I made it seem like it was just me. It was just me by myself, and I know it wasn't. And that was, it was really selfish of me. Right this moment, there is a mad rush in America. Apple, Amazon, Facebook, dozens more. And, you know, I felt, I felt arrogant and cocky. Thinking of it now, thinking about it now, I felt like real arrogant and real cocky when I said, um, in the song I wrote, it's called Ain't Easy. And I put, uh, I said, uh, God, you put me through so much, I better make it there. You know, at that time, I wrote that song. I was unaware. And I just, I just been spiritually growing so much. And I've been evolving so much. And everything I've been reading, everything I've been reading, I was starting to lose track of, like, God has been right there the whole time. And it's the devil. The devil been tricking me. And, you know, he's been, he put a blindfold over me. 
he been wanting me to spiritually grow. You know, he been he been That's I facts. mean he been wanting me to reach my higher self. That's facts. That's a, uh, That's facts. But I didn't see the trick. I didn't I didn't see the trick and I didn't see it until I came I am in Atlanta right want now. None of us to succeed. And I'm here with, none uh, of us to, here with a friend. To grow spiritually and, uh, in God. He, he was telling me this, this life stage life changing story of his. And it just reminded me it just reminded me of everything I've been through and everything I experienced and everything I started to forget. And I started to forget these things because say like uh, in the books I've been reading, I've been reading self uh, self image psychology. Um, it teach you it teaches you on how to so it's 10.30 on a Wednesday, and apparently I've sold close to $3,000 in sales on Amazon already. Mm-hmm. Expand your self-image. I- Alright. So yeah, guys, that's, that's the end of the video. Um, I'm not sure if there's another... Uh, if there's another video to that but even that man just this humble comments that he was making uh talking about that uh he realized that god was giving him strength to go through what he was going through and uh you know that's uh, there's a scripture that says they that wait upon the lord Shall renew it. Re, shall renew their strength. Sorry. Shall mount up with wings like eagle. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. So I say that just to say that when we start trusting in God, um, when we start having faith in God, you know, anytime we direct our focus or attention on God. Whether it's through prayer, meditation, um, praising, or just simply just reading his word about him. We gain newfound strength within ourselves, you know. And, uh, man, I'm just glad that he, like, when he was talking about that, he was capitalizing on so many scriptures. You know, like, just saying that's, it may sound simple and humble, but, like, that is so evident throughout the whole Bible. Again, this video was a blessing, you know, just to hear this guy humbly talk and recognizing that God was giving him strength, man, I'm blessed. You know, I hope you guys are blessed. And uh, it goes to say that anything that you guys are going through, because I know me, I like to reflect on me a lot. Like, I'm going through this. I'm, I, I, I. It's not just me going through stuff, you know? You guys, the viewers, may be going through stuff. You know, I know know a whole bunch of other people that are going through stuff. And especially in this pandemic time, the world is going through a lot of stuff. You know? And, uh... Just keep, yo, just keep... Just keep trusting God. Let's just keep trusting God. You know, it's not easy. You know, but... God is able to take us through. You know, we just take him at his word and trust him at his word. And, uh, yeah. It's just an amazing testimony that I heard from this brother. Um, definitely, you know, gonna keep an eye on this brother. And, uh, if he has any new content, like, I, like I'm, I'm just excited, you know, that he's taking a step for a spiritual journey. And I hope you guys were blessed. Don't forget to com- like, comment, and subscribe, you know, uh, in the comment section. You know, say which part was your favorite part of this reaction video. Or if you guys have any ideas for videos to react to, let me know in the comments below. And, uh, yeah, man. And if this is your first time watching this video, hey, welcome to the blessed family. You know, it's the best family to be in. But uh, I hope you guys were truly blessed out of this. Um, you know, stay blessed, nothing less. You know, until next time, we'll meet again. He's the only one to notice. Feeling this pain for real. I think I just to take.